In this video, we will show how to properly install Zekeke inside your Shopify store. Let's start from your admin dashboard. Go inside Add Apps. And now let's open the Shopify App Store to search and find for Zekeke. Click in the search bar and type in Zekeke. We will find our public listing. Now, let's add the app to your store. Click on the button Add App. As you can see, now we can install the app by confirming these configurations. We can start our free trial for 14 days by clicking in this button. Once you click on the button, you will be redirected to the approved subscription page where you will not be charged because of the free trial. Once you activate your free trial, you will have a full access to the Zekeke Visual Commerce platform. Here you can set up your Zekeke account by following these simple steps in this list. You can see the days left in your free trial here in the bottom left. And you can select your solutions here, the Visual Product Customizer or the Product Configurator for made to order products or the 3D and AR Viewer. Remember that you have full access to the Zekeke Visual Platform during the, your free trial. You can always switch solution here and select all the options and features that you want in the left menu. Now, let's go back to your Shopify admin dashboard. And of course, please remember that this is the only way to access the Zekeke app by going inside your dashboard, select apps, install apps, and click on Zekeke. And there you go our Zekeke dashboard open it up by just clicking that button. In this video, we will show you how to create a customizable product inside the visual customizer of Zekeke. To create a customizable product, you need to go inside the section here on the main menu on the left. Today, we will show you how to create a product from scratch. By following this process, you can create a customizable product that you can later associate with one of the products in your store to turn it into a customizable product. Please remember that Zekeke does not create products at your store, but it allows you to turn products in your store's catalog into customizable products. Let's select the option. First, let's name the product and then upload the image. Then we can add as a bold side, for example, a front and back or start setting the print area. Inside the ruler, we can select the measure units, for example, and then name it. But let's start with the ruler. Once we select the ruler, then we can select the shape of the print area. Here we can have a circular, we can create a polygonal area. You can use a PNG mask to create the Pintera or even upload a PDF to create big lines. Then we can go back and indicate the product size, edit areas and move it and zoom with a hand. Again, we can select the width and height in the measure unit by directly putting numbers here or just use and custom sizes. Then put the name of the print area, select if we want a cropped print file. By default, the print file parts of the design that exceed the print area limits get removed. If you uncheck this box, the print file will include the entire design, including the parts exceeding the limits of the print area. Then, let's save it. We can change the image and we can add another size if we want. The variance. We can go directly to variation, on that, just go to the preview. This product 
As variants, we need to complete the setup first, and then we can connect the store in order to import variants from the store itself. Let's go inside the preview right now. As you can see, we are almost ready to publish the product and start selling. We have the name of the product, the automatic default code, the side that we created, and the print area. We can just save the product or save and publish. Keep in mind that we have now created a customizable product, but that is not connected with any product on a store and your catalog is not here yet. So if you wish to start selling, you need to connect the Zekeke account to your store and then associate the products you just created with the product in your store by just clicking on publish here. Then you will select the product you want to apply those edits settings and customizable rules to, and then you are able to actually publish the product to your store and let customers apply all the customization rule that you have set up inside the visual customizer of Zekeke okay, and start selling those customizable products. You can see all basic customization tools, so the text, the upload images, galleries are activated by default. However, you might need to limit the way your customers may will and can personalize your product. So if you need to disable or limit one or more customization tools on the entire product, or for example, on each side, or if you wish to customize the print file options, you need to create a printing method. If you want your customers to start from pre-made designs, or you need them to have strict rules on design elements position, well, the best option is to create a pre-design template that you can have by clicking on see all available tools. After that, remember that in order to test your customizable product and generate print ready files, you don't need to actually publish your product live, but you can use the internal text customizer. After you complete the customization, you just need to click on place test order. Inside orders, you will find all the details and print ready files of your product, even if you created that from scratch.